Hi everyone, welcome back to my craft room. If you're new to my craft room, then welcome. Happy Friday everyone. It's Dollar Tree haul day. Um, I made it out to the Dollar Tree in the morning, nice and early. It was nice. I got there, there was like two cars in the parking lot. And let me tell you what, it filled up quick because by the time I was ready to check out, I had to stand in line halfway down an aisle. But other than that, it was a good trip. And I went over to the bigger Dollar Tree this time that I like to go to. I didn't get a ton of stuff, but I did take a bunch of pictures because you guys know I'm not really into too much of Halloween decorating. I love the fall decorations. Um, and I like the cutesy Halloween decorations to go in here and there. But I did take a lot of pictures of things that I saw that maybe you guys would be interested in. So first let me show you what I picked up that I, you know, normally get. Um, I got another pack of the Brillo uh, sponges, nothing special, but I like these out in the kitchen and, you know, I just use them till they get a little dirty look and toss them out, or usually I switch them to one that I use just to clean up messes that we have around or something, and then I'll replace the other one for dishes or whatever. So I got another pack of those, and then I picked up another, actually I picked up two packs of these, uh, the cream cheese and chives. These are Lance, and you get six, um, four packs of the crackers, and these are really good. So I got two of those, and these I was so happy to find. These are really hard to find at the Dollar Tree. They have a lot of them, you know, that have their different flavored ones, but the original, just the plain potato sticks is what we really like, so I haven't seen these, I don't think, in like maybe six months. But I grabbed two bags of these while I was there, and uh, yeah, I was happy to find those. And these are what, four ounce bags. And then I grabbed a bag of these uh, <clears throat> Benzel's Pretzel Rods. Um, I haven't tried these before, but I'm going to give these a try. And this is an 8 ounce bag, so we'll see how they are. But I do love pretzel rods, so a noisy car going down my street. And then I got another jar of the uh, Honey Roasted Peanuts. These are the salted ones. I love these to snack on. So I just got one this time. I've been buying two at a time, but then I eat two at a time, so... I just got one this time. And then I picked up this Power Stick 3-in-1 Body Wash Shampoo Conditioner for my husband. This is a big size. It's 50% more, it says. It's 18 fluid ounces. And it's, this is the, uh, called Clue, Cool Blue Water. I can't talk again today. And uh, it smells really nice. So I got that for him. And then I grabbed two more packs of these while I was there. Um, last couple times at my grocery store, so they've only had like the really big, big packs, and um, so I just grabbed a couple of these little ones for now. And they're just fine, they're just a bounce, and that's, these are the um, outdoor fresh ones, that's my favorite scent. So let me show you what I did pick up. Now these they have every single year, is these styrofoam pumpkins, and I absolutely love these. I usually paint them so they're not such a you know, bright, funny orange color, but you can paint them to look more like a real pumpkin and stuff. And I love doing little crafting projects with these, so I got a couple things in mind for those for the fall, so I got two of them to put away for right now. And then I picked up another pack of the um, pipe cleaners. These They're called tinsel stems at Dollar Tree. You get 45 in here, and these are great for the wreath. I do want to make one more fall wreath with the uh, mesh, which I'm really not happy with from Dollar Tree this year. It's just, the weave on it is just so wide. But I am going to make another one since I bought the mesh already. And get that going here. And then I found these paint brushes. These are a little bit different than the other ones. They didn't have the ones that I really, really like. And those are um, these with the white they're more of a light colored bristle, but these are really nice. So I'm going to try these. These seem a little bit more flexible than some of the other ones, but these were the only decent ones that I saw there this week. And their Crafter Square section was really, really packed, but pretty much everything I've already seen before. And then I picked up two more of the, um, what are they calling it here? They're calling it lace ribbon. It looks like little embroidered edges that you would see on little old like pillowcases or something, and I just thought that would be nice to do some projects with. And you get 9 feet on here, and they're .63 inches, and you get 3 yards. So, good deal. So I grabbed two of them because I haven't seen them. I've seen them before, but not lately. 
And then I did get another couple pairs of sunglasses because I am constantly dropping them, breaking them, losing them. So that is why I buy them at the Dollar Tree. So, and these are really nice. <clears throat> Excuse me. They're very clear. So I got myself two more pairs of those because I like to keep one in my car. And then I saw these little, these are called 3D stickers, 3D sticker bag. And um, they're really cute. I thought these would be nice to put on something. You could put these on a card or a gift or something. And it's, um, has like a little pocket in there and has little stars. Uh, it's like a little shaker, shaker pocket. And this thing says chill out, cool. It has all kinds of little different sayings on the stars. I thought that was really cute. And I think so. I've seen people haul these before, but I've never seen them at my Dollar Tree. And then this one is a little bit different. They're all like in a little jar, it looks like. And this one has all kinds of like different shaped little gemstones. So I thought that was pretty cool. So I don't know what I'm going to do with them yet, but I'll use them on something. And then I picked up four packs of these little clamps just to do some of my wood projects and things with. I have these little ones that they had at the Dollar Tree. They have these little ones, and these work great for little woodworking projects that I do here in my craft room. So I thought these bigger ones would be uh, really good too, because sometimes those are just too small to fit over some of the wider pieces of wood. So I did pick up four packs of these. So I all set on my little clamps. And I did pick up some nautical rope, and this nautical rope, let me grab the other nautical rope. Hang on one second. I just want to show you guys the difference here. Now these are only 9 feet. The other ones used to get, I think, 13 feet or 11 feet something. I don't remember. I don't have a package for those. But I mean, this is really nice, and I'm actually kind of happy about this, but it is much, much smaller than the other nautical rope that they've been selling. So this is the difference in the size now. But I think this is going to work out great for a lot of little projects where that stuff is just a little bit too big. So you get 9.5 feet on here and it's really nice. I got some of the white colored rope that they had and I really don't care for that at all because it just all comes apart real easy. So I did grab three of those. It's the first time I found these skinnier ones. But I think they'll be fun to do something with. And now this was my most exciting find there. Um, I did pick up four packs of each of these and these are, it's a pack of wood planks. This one I open just so I can show you. And you get six in here. And it doesn't say the size on here. And the grammar will work because I like to tell you guys what size they are. So these are, you get these wood planks, and these are great for doing some craft projects with. So these are seven inches long, and they are about two and three quarters inches wide. And you get six in each pack. So that was an exciting find. I've never seen these before at any of my Dollar Trees. I grabbed four of those. I wish I could have bought the whole case, but, you know, I didn't hit the lottery this week. And then I picked up four of the square ones. Now these are really, oh, this does have the measurements on here. See, I could have looked right there. So these are, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, four and a half inch squares. And, I think, and they're really nice. So I think we can come up with some really good stuff to use them. It comes in a little Ziploc bag, too, so you can... You know, store them in there nice and keep them nice and dry. But yeah, so I got four packs of those. And I, like I said, I wish I could have bought the whole case. And these were the only two different sizes that I saw that they had. And then I did pick up two more of the stars. I've picked these up before. Um, I think these will be nice to do something with for Christmas time. So I wanted to grab these while I see them. Because, you know, once it gets to down to the wire where everybody's Christmas crafting, it's kind of hard to find stuff. So... If you have an idea for something you want to do, you need to grab this stuff now. And then I did buy just a few more leaves and things. Now these I haven't had before. I don't know. I'm pretty sure Dollar Tree's probably had them. I don't know. Maybe I just didn't see them. These are the oak leaves. I usually get these maple leaves here. And I picked these up too. Now this this is more of the oak. This is says maple, but this is the oak leaf. Um, and it has like an acorn in there and some berries on this bunch. And then this one has a little pumpkin in there and some berries. And I love decorating these. And then these are just, I just thought these colors were really, really pretty of these maple leaves. 
But yeah, I really like these. I haven't seen these just in a, you know, just a bunch of leaves. I've seen them, I think, you know, where it's had other things hooked onto it, like berries and things. But yeah, I was really happy to find these, just so you can kind of mix it up a little bit. I'm going to stick them right here in my pile of flowers here. I keep all my flowers in a big bucket that I got at Dollar Tree, and then I just kind of keep stacking them up here. It's getting pretty high. But that is all that I picked up this week at the Dollar Tree. And like I said, I have some pictures I'm going to put at the end. Because, you know, most of the new stuff that they had out was for Halloween and stuff. So, I hope you guys enjoy looking at those. So, thanks so much for watching, everybody. I will see you guys all next time. Have a great day, everyone.